This is a tutorial for the F major scale. You'll notice that for the F major scale, we have a unique fingering. So we have one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four for the right hand. But the left hand, we have five, four, three, two, one, three, two, one, like we did for the C and G scale, G major. So you're gonna have a B flat. One of the reasons that you have to, well, probably the reason you have to use your fourth finger to play the B flat in the right hand is that that's the way your hand is shaped. So it it's just easier to do that rather than that wouldn't work. So four, then you cross one, two, three, four. Four, three, two, one, four, three, two, one. But in the left hand, see how easy that is? The two plays the B flat. So you can use the five, four, three, two, one, three, two, one. on the keys. All right, so those are the fingerings for the F major scale. And then the arpeggios are um, F, A, C, F. So no flats in there because we just don't play a B flat. And then the F in the left hand. When we look at the chords for the F major scale, You'll notice that in the four chord, there is a flat, there's a B flat. And in the five, seven, there's a B flat. So the F chord is our tonic chord, well, first chord in the scale and the chord progression. And so um, it's F-A-C-E. And so we've got our F-A-C-E. Not E, excuse me. F A C. That is our triad in root position because the F is at the bottom and that's what spells the chord. And then you'll notice that the four chord is going to be a new ah, B flat. So that's our fourth, fourth chord in the chord progression for the F major scale. So one, two, three, four, B flat. So um, if we did that would be our second inversion, F, B flat, D. So let's look and see if that's what it is. That is what it is, F. B flat D. So if we go from our F chord, then we keep our thumb on the F, we move our third finger to the B flat and our fifth finger to the D. Okay, and then, so B flat is our four chord, so C is our five seven chord. So we have a C7. So our C7 that's our C7. So if we were to invert it once and then we get rid of that note which is our fifth. So now we have a C B flat and actually I played that with my fourth finger five, four, and then my E is my bottom and my um, thumb. Okay, so let's see if that's correct. E, B flat, C. Okay, so when I play that chord progression then, it's gonna go F, A, C, F, B flat, D, come back to F, A, C, keep my pinky on the C, put my fourth finger on the B flat, and move my thumb down to the E. 
and then back to FAC. So let me play that again.